We don't like to throw around the term genius very often. We don't hear it much in this studio at all. But this guy may have just earned the title. Meet Caleb Olson. He's a software engineer by day, but by night he's a very gifted inventor. And he may have just solved one of the biggest problems for pet owners all over the world. Now, Caleb has devised a drone system to detect pick up and throw away number twos left by doggos, <laughs> dubbed the poop copter. The simple but effective design could make your backyard free of doggy doo-doo in one fell swoop. Uh, we welcome this genius Caleb Olsen to The Morning Show. Hi, Caleb. Hey, how are you? Thanks uh, for having me. We're great. We obviously understand the need for such an invention, but what prompted you to come up with the poop copter, this contraption? Mm. Yeah, so, I mean, everyone's got... I mean, a lot of people have dogs, and poop's kind of a, an annoying part of having a dog. And a couple of years ago, I realized I had, well, I had a security camera in my backyard, and I realized it was a basically a data source I could use. Um, so I built a dog poop detector using the security camera, which was processing on the live stream from the, the security camera to detect whether my dog was pooping in the backyard which is sweet, especially where I'm at. There's a lot of snow uh, right there in, in frame. She's pooping in the snow, my dog Twinkie. Um, and then it'll just get hidden. So it'll detect her pooping and then um, keep keep track of it so I can pull it up on my phone and find it later. But uh, I still got to go and get the poop. So that's that's kind of what set me on this like poop journey, basically, I've been on for the last few years, um, mm. culminating in the in the poop, <laughs> the poop copter. Okay, so... Uh, which is... Go ahead. So if Twinkie does a winky in the snow, then you still have to go and uh, pick it up. So the poop copter doesn't go down and pick it up. Sorry, the, that was the dog poop detector, which I built a couple of years ago and was sort of the, the predecessor to the poop copter. The poop copter oh, um, flies around your yard. You saw it in the, in the video before, but it's basically flying around your yard. There's a camera inside there. You can see it patrolling. And then it's <laughs> using that same machine learning technology for detecting poop. And as it's patrolling the yard, if it sees a poop in real time, it'll stop and descend <laughs> and perform a precision landing on the poop. And then um, using the mechanism, which is on the base of the drone, it can just rotate. It's very low fidelity, no motors or anything. All it does is rotate 30 degrees and it scoops and closes, um, picking up whatever's in the bounds of the yeah. poop copter's box. Okay. And then what happens? So after the poop's been, yeah. poop's been picked up, uh, where's it go? Do, do, you, do you drop it over the fence yeah. of the neighbours? Yeah. Is that uh, release? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, it depends on the, uh, the model. If it goes direct to consumer, if people have their own. Uh, I spent quite a bit of time um, enabling a feature I've dubbed the sky dump. Uh, it could basically spin <laughs> in mid-air fast enough in place such that the mechanism flings open and you can, <laughs> you can drop the poop uh, on your neighbor's yard or just Great. wherever you want. Uh, <laughs> OK. Um, you presented this idea to a crowd uh, recently. How, how did the crowd respond? Yeah, there's uh, a mixture of laughter <laughs> and uh, a lot of applause. Um, there's, a, there's a lot of buzz generated from, from the, the poop copter, which is very... Yeah. Very childishly named. Yeah, I love... But does it, does, can it have a mind of its own, or do you have to sit there and at the controls and, and go and do it? Because it'd be nice just to have it sitting somewhere in the backyard and it just knows yep. to go and do it, because if you have to sit there with the controller, you may as well just go and pick it up yourself. Yeah, so that clip right there, uh, mm -hmm. where it's kind of just buzzing around the yard, that's it in the patrol mode, where it's going in a grid-like fashion in a predefined area. So in that in that shot it was my backyard mm. and it's just going in a grid pattern on its own completely uncontrolled and looking for poop and if it finds the poop it'll do the landing process Love and it. pick it up and then go drop it off uh caleb absolutely fascinating we appreciate your time this morning thanks for talking to <laughs> us thanks caleb that's great thank you we're back after this <laughs>